Hey guys, and welcome to What's Up Jude. Hello guys. Hi guys. And welcome back to this new episode of What's Up Jude. Yes. I hope you are all alright and safe and that this first month of January went well for everyone. And first of all, I would like to thank, well, we would like to thank our listeners from Australia uh, and South Korea. Yeah, and also thank you. like the United States. That is crazy. Like, yeah, <laughs> what? You're listening to us. And so, thanks to our French listener too. Yeah, because, yeah. You know, that's, that's home country. Our home country, yeah. <laughs> so we are super happy to create and share the, this podcast with you. So guys, please continue to listen. And again, don't be shy and send us messages because we would be very happy to receive one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so how are you, Leslie? And how have you been during this month of January? Um, can you talk about something positive that happened to you or just that you want to share? Because since we are in 2021, we need to start on a good note. Yeah, sure. Uh, accent, though? <laughs> <laughs> uh, January was pretty good for me. Uh, well, I had my final exams as you had, as you had, Alex. Um, but uh, I'm like re relieved because uh, you know it's the end of the semester and new projects are coming so i'm really happy because i've worked so hard during uh this second lockdown in uh november and december so i'm just happy you know that uh it's it's, it's over yeah it's over and we're going to do a new semester uh our last semester between uh, you know holidays <laughs> yeah <laughs> so yes i'm happy and i also spend some time with my family so that was pretty cool uh, especially in those times uh what about you dude well How was this january month just like you super relieved because the final exams are finally done yes but it was yeah. yeah, it was hard because we did it in uh, at home. So yeah, online school is hard, guys. That was like, weird and hard. But like, you know, when you're taking an exam and then you're super stressed because your Wi-Fi can, like, yeah. be and gone even in after, a second. <laughs> and even after, because some teachers are going to, you know, plagiarism uh, yeah, platforms. Sorry. And you're like, okay, so... I did it myself, but you're still stressed about it. So uh, really glad that this thing is over. Yeah. And I'm willing for this semester to, you know, do better things. And I don't know, like, I've been thinking about what can I do in my mm, future life. Yeah. Because, like, I really want to try new things mm. and make projects. But, you know, this time is, like, these times are a little bit complicated. So, mm. you know, just taking the time to reflect on my life. That is mm. very deep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it. And I like us the usual, I spend time with my family. So, yeah. Mm. Anyway, today, today, guys, we want to talk about what it's like to be an introvert or an extrovert person. Because we think like it is a pretty big feature that can impact our everyday life. And please, like this is our point of view. Yeah, like, sure. It's not something... I think it's complicated to just, you know, summarize this... Um, I forgot the words. <laughs> this I, uh, feature, I guess. Yes. Uh, you know, like I think everybody got... Everybody got get gods i struggled everybody, today <laughs> it's okay like everybody what do you what do you want to say different point of view and different experience so i think introverted person and extroverted person is complicated to define and also little reminder we're not doctors 
yeah. or professionals in this field. So just please, please be kind. You know, it's a yeah, it's only our point of view. Like yeah, like and how we see episodes. this. Yeah. So for for me, I would say like an extrovert is a person who is super social and tries to make everyone comfortable. And an introvert for me would be someone that is like also social. Want, they want to be social, but in their own way. They won't mm -hmm. show as much or they won't deliver as much, en as much energy as an extroverted person. So I feel like introverted person would rather put a little int, hints. Yeah, that was, <laughs> my pronunciation was bad. Like little <laughs> hints and yeah, like you need to get those hints in order to understand them. So yeah, what what is your definition like? What would how would you like describe an extroverted person or an introverted introverted person? First, I need to say that I love the subject. Okay. Okay. I think <laughs> I think I think it's so interesting, and. I, I just love it. Okay. Anyway, um, in my opinion, uh, an extrovert is someone who likes uh, being around people and sharing with them, but um, not sharing just the basic things, you know, uh, yeah. they also tend to be more social, as you said, but I think they are not like, oh, yes, I'm, I'm friend uh, with everyone, but more likely to be, I can talk with anyone and share something. Um, they are really comfortable with people, even if it's uh, with strangers. Uh, whereas I would define an introverted person as someone who struggles to have a little talks uh, with mm. every everyone, you know. I want also to be clear on this point. Uh, an introverted person and a shy person is not the same yeah. thing. The, okay. This is not necessarily the same thing no at all and i i think it's really complicated to define these terms but i would say in a really simple way uh that an extrovert is someone who finds energy when he is around people and more people they are better it is whereas an introvert has to be alone to like re recharge like yeah. uh, his, his batteries have the like, battery fill up yeah right. exactly and introverted person don't need um an environment where everyone is moving to you know to to feel full of energy and well i i, I think it's more deeper but i would say it like that it is like that yeah honestly yeah like, how, how would you consider yourself? Well, as far as I'm concerned... <laughs> that, was a big, love... that was a big sigh. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> um, as far as I'm concerned, um, I would say I'm an introvert. But... But. There is a but. but. Oh, my God. There is a but. Uh, in sim it's important to clarify, to clarify Sorry, that someone is never ever uh, a 100% introverted person, 100% person, extroverted person. I think you are both. Um, and, you know, like... But you tend to have this side who is more yes, dominant. Yes, sure. But word is n not black and white or we don't live in a bipolar word. Yeah. So I think it's important to, you know, uh, clarify this point. So, why do I think I'm an introvert? Yeah, like why? Uh, well, basically, as I said, I'm not really comfortable with uh, all these little talks. And to be honest, sometimes <laughs> I do believe it's better <laughs> not to talk rather than talking about the weather, for example. Okay. I, I think it's boring, so... That's okay. If, like, okay. Also, I'm really comfortable with silence. You know, I can silence. eat silent with people and, you know, just to be okay with that. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's a, a, you know, a point of introverted person, but anyway. Being okay with silence. Yes. Um, 
I'm happy uh, also to see my friends, but after that, I feel exhausted. Um, not about them, of course, but just, you know, uh, like share all my energy with them. Then when I go home, <laughs> I literally can shut my mouth for hours. After. <laughs> <laughs> and so I tend to overthink and pay attention to tiny details, which makes me anxious. Um, I also struggle to express my feelings. Uh, well, I, I think okay. you, you, I think you noticed it, but anyway, um, <laughs> I don't know if it's just about introverted person but that's what i've been through so you know we heard to share and also dudes um i just want to say like don't judge someone on what they look like because yeah people often told me that i was very social yeah i need that to, to say something about that because at first i was like oh my god she's like talking to everyone she seems comfortable <laughs> and then and then like I, I I got to know her and then she was like, no, I'm an introverted person. Like, I don't yeah. like to talk for nothing. I want to, if, if I talk about something, it's going to, we're going to get deep in it, you know? Mm. So, so yeah, I was surprised. I think it's very like personal and it's just you, like you, you are the only one who can describe yourself as you are because, you know, you are you, you? you are you <laughs> <laughs> so obviously you are the only one who can judge you uh so yeah well i talk too much uh what about <laughs> you alex <laughs> well i think you guys saw it well hear it listen to it i don't know what words to to say <laughs> but i'm an extroverted person like i don't like i don't have any struggle to express myself or talk to people if i have to but again, I think it depends, as you say, mm. Leslie. But yeah, I like to, I don't know, I like to get to know the person when I'm mm. in a new environment. I want to make them comfortable. Um, but I, I will never like cross this barrier, I guess. Mm. Because, you know, sometimes there are some people who are so much in, energized that they, I don't know, it yeah, doesn't I, match. I it doesn't yeah. match with the energy of the other. Too people. much. Too much is too much. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes I tend to be like that, and yeah. some people told me to like calm a little bit. You know. Yeah, because, I told you like yesterday <laughs> because I'm so, I'm so hype like <laughs> for nothing. <laughs> I I would like literally I don't know eat something I like and I would be hey <laughs> yeah. So anyway, if a person is too, I don't know, intimi inti intimidating. Yeah, I, 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 think it's, I think it's it. Is it? Anyway, you guys yeah. understood. I <laughs> won't have the same amount of energy. Like I mm. would, I'm going yeah. to observe and then mm. I'm going to release the energy that I need to mm. talk to this person or interact yeah. with this person. Like you can adapt uh, your yeah. energy, your energy. Uh, depends on the person with who I am yeah. with. <laughs> that I was think with with you with who I am. It's just who I am. yeah. It depends. So yeah, okay, I... guys. Uh, it's the weekend. Okay, it's we, like four p.m. right now. <laughs> <laughs> that is not even that is not even late, but you know. No, but it's almost a snack. So snack time. It. Anyway, so. <laughs> Another question, like, I feel like the quarantine has impacted our social skills. Oh my gosh. And yeah. can you talk about that, Leslie? Like, do you mm. feel okay. because of the quarantine, it did impact even more your introverted side? Or, I don't know, it changed mm. something in you? Mm. Well, I think I feel even more introvert than I was before. Oh my god. <laughs> I say that in a dramatic way, but um Yes you did. I tend to cut myself from the outside world um more often. And I well I don't see the I don't see that as a positive or 
negative things mm -hmm. thing and i just uh <laughs> i just live without um the quarantine helps me do introvert introversion work work yeah introversion work like in yeah like to do an as an inventory about my thoughts my actions who i am etc <laughs> what do you like <laughs> yeah and um as you said um well i i don't know how to communicate even with my friends to be honest that's and, weird um, to say i don't yeah. know how to communicate guys i'm sorry <laughs> yeah i don't know how to do that <laughs> it's really hard because well it's been almost a year and like with alex we see each other like three times that three times yeah, ah three oh, okay times. in real life <laughs> yeah in real life yeah like zoom is our best friend and so um i don't know how to act in society anymore it's mm -hmm. weird i know but um i worked this summer so it helped me um but you know second lockdown came in november and so here we go again yeah and that's it i feel what about you. you what about you what quarantine what, what about you? me what about me yeah. well <laughs> you <laughs> i feel like for me it has been like impact deeply like deep yeah okay i need to say something is the thing is i'm an extroverted person but mm -hmm. but i tend to be a lot a lot in my own world yeah like i would literally be in the in a i don't know how do you say that <laughs> in a place but yeah. at the same time i want oh, in I, your mind i'm not here oh yeah i i, so, I but I don't think it's a uh, like an introvert person. No, but that's it. weird. But, yeah, I know, I know. But um, well, you know, that's you. <laughs> and then, and then, I don't know. Something is just in front of my eyes, and then people would talk about it. I don't know. Two weeks later, and I would yeah. be like, "What? What happened? What happened? Yeah. I was there, yeah. but I didn't see anything." So yeah. Anyway, yeah. so I used to talk like and try to catch up with everyone. But now, I don't feel the urge to talk or ask mm. people because yeah. of the quarantine. Well, I, well, yeah. But if learn... I want, I really yes. want to, like, but I think sometimes I'm, I'm like, if this person, like, doesn't come up to me, maybe yeah. I'm going to bother them with my text or my call. Yeah. So okay, yeah. I've been thinking more of my actions than... Mm. I used to do before the quarantine. Yes, but uh, yes, I think it's um, well. I think it's a really strange year, and especially for students, because um, well, also I need to say something. Um, <laughs> uh, I don't know if you heard, guys, about French baccalaureate. I don't know how to pronounce it. Again. <laughs> yeah, it's like the high school degree. And the um, it has been cancelled. Uh, In 2020. Yeah. 21 yeah, yeah. this year. This year is... Well, not like... the degree. Well, not the degree is not cancelled. But, but some of the, the exam exams. Yes, exams. Cancelled. And, um, well, it's ridiculous because... Uh, like high school students, well, went sorry, went to um to high school every day during this year, and like they get a degree. And we students, college students, we like we're, we're struggling we're, here. Yeah, we're at home, and we're like, oh my god, I need to do a Zoom class or something like that. And you know that you, I don't know, but I feel like my degree is not going to have so much value. value yeah and i think it's also like i think it has an impact on our um future life and our thoughts about it because maybe like i feel um more like on you myself you guys can't with, see but she's yeah doing some with, hands movements here yeah withdraw withdraw um 
into myself you know like i just think about how i'm going to survive anyway. i kind of get it mm -hmm. but you want to say if if i'm right again <laughs> uh that because of the situ the whole situation everyone's behavior has been impacted yeah. and we 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 will ne like not never but we are going to tend to be more introvert introverted than extroverted uh i don't know if anyone because but me i will uh, uh i know because maybe of... it's going maybe it's going to be the to stay in your mind because yes, you have but... been super impacted because of the situation it also has an impact on you so you yes. think this because it has it had an impact at the beginning for example of your 20s mm -hmm. it's gonna stick to you after yeah. that yeah i'm oh. pretty sure and it's for me it's introverted person and for some people it's the contrary and they need to express yeah. themselves and they need to share with people and they realize that they didn't share enough with people so now at the end of all this thing this yeah. huge, huge thing they're going to share more to you know meet some people and going to well have fun uh, <laughs> and i yes. really want to have fun like i miss <laughs> i miss going out <laughs> but yeah <laughs> i don't um, know also little uh, fun fact uh, not really fun by the way but during <laughs> this year <laughs> little fun fact that's really fun by the way and uh, during this year i realized we are like we live in an extroverted world world sorry um i know it's weird oh. but let me explain like people often see extroverts as good things and introverts as bad things and well you feel it um when you say you haven't texted people for a while like this is okay uh but, it's okay yeah. and it's the same thing in a professional world if you say you're an introverted person it's often like a like the people in front of you are going to judge you and i don't know why but you just feel it and when you say you're an extroverted person it's also quality like it's okay that's weird be. yes and i i think i i just we just have to accept that some people are like that are different. some people yes exactly and why where why do we live in an extroverted world i think it's because we live in a connected world uh where if you have not uh the typical social skills you seem weird um out of place sometimes yes but introverted person have just uh their own type of social skills you know mm -hmm. they they they're not um they don't talk every minute of their life but when they talk talk you know what i mean something um, really meaningful yes yeah. not about the weather uh <laughs> the weather is pretty good actually <laughs> uh well not here but um okay <laughs> that's okay you know it's raining by the way um so i need to say just okay. uh memorize this sentence of the episode society has to stop defining people, has to stop putting people in boxes and be more open-minded. And that's pretty much it, you know, period. Like, that's yeah, okay. That's, that's the thing. Yes. What do you think about it, Alex? I honestly, yeah, I do feel the world is made for, like, it has been made mm. for extroverted person. But, um, like, ah, that's, that's complicated to say, but I feel like the world is changing right now, you know? Mm, yeah. So our generation did understand that we are different and we mm. need to take in consideration everyone and make little efforts in both ways, in both mm. sides. Like, for example, I don't know, if you know that 
the person is extroverted and the other one is introverted, you you need to push yourself and make efforts to include this introverted person. I don't know in your yes oh yes you don't have to change the person I yeah you, you need to uh, well we need to understand more the human yes. as a human yes. not as something we we put in boxes as you said yes. and like i just said these norms are changing i feel like mm. i'm going to this is off topic but i feel like our generation Mm. is really going to change the world yes and, and we, we we saw that this year with um you know like um environmental issues uh racism issues and you know like we we just open our eyes about the world that's I have, it. <laughs> I have a song in my mind right now but i'm not going to sing anyway so yeah those norms that people used to live on Mm. are yeah. we are over it yes and i think also about a professional world we have to stop like uh you know ask question that we know the answer like why did you apply yeah like we have to stop define people by as, what as but yes by degrees or and start uh different people for who they are and what do they know, like yes and their personal belief i don't know yeah that's like a, not their hobbies for example if you learn uh piano it's also it's like um it's also valuable yes yeah. then have a degree it's just another skill and i think uh like all who the word is going to change in few years because we are going to uh, be like the at, adults. Yes, later. and at the top of um, companies, you know, mm. like, uh, in 15 years, uh, some of us are going to be uh, leaders or something like that. Anyway, so I would like to say, dudes, our dudes, our listeners, that's how you are called. Please be kind and try to understand everyone you meet. Mm. and try to make them comfortable and yeah like that's it <laughs> accept, accept people for who they are um don't try to change them because uh you Some for example, of, yeah because you're an extroverted person it does not mean that you have to change introverted person uh like accept just accept and because we don't realize but some some people are really trying their best to communicate with others yeah. and sometimes we do not see that and that's something really deep inside of them like talking to a to a person is a, a real challenge for some of us so mm. understand and be in French, she would be like, Soyez compatissant. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I like, can't say that. I can't say that in English, no. but yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and also, just be yourself, especially for an introverted person, because as we said, we live in an extroverted world. And just don't wear a mask. Well, yeah, it's not <laughs> <laughs> not about the situation, but uh, in your mind, you know, just don't um, cover your uh, personality and just you fit in. Yes, you don't have to fit in. Yes, exactly, because people can feel it. You know, if you uh, are not yourself, and right away there is an energy around you, and they just feel it. So it's not worth it um i have a yeah, question think, maybe yeah. like do you have any advice for people who are extrovert yeah. extroverted and when they meet an introverted person like um, you you won't say directly that this person is introverted but yeah sure uh but i would say meeting yeah. like make someone comfortable 
Yeah. Well, I think the most important when you meet someone for the first time, whatever, uh, you know, extroverted, introverted, whatever, uh, just be kind and don't judge too much. Uh, I think it's hard because, you know, we tend to judge even ourselves. Really but just, easily, yeah. Yes. Just don't judge. Be kind and... Um, <laughs> Okay, in French, we have this um, expression. French uh, class with Leslie, 101. <laughs> Go. Um, it's like, il faut de tout pour faire un monde. And, um, <laughs> well, you can translate it by, uh, like, we need different things to build this word. Uh, it's not very a good translation. Sorry about that, you know. I've got a teacher, a uh, translation teacher. Uh, but it's not really really good but you won't be happy <laughs> <laughs> you got the idea like we need different things to build this word mm -hmm. and it's important because we if we are the same if people like are just the same like it's boring you can um you can exchange i don't know how to say that but you can uh, like this is um exchange yes i guess Wait share okay so as i was saying <laughs> um so we need different things to build this word so we don't need like clone i don't think it's i i do not think clones clones yeah like yeah. we need a diversity like variety that, of people yeah, yeah. that is and i think that's it you know like we we that's, that's pretty much it I would say like be aware of your surroundings yep. and again let the other person express um, themselves too mm -hmm. not do please do not be the one who's making things awkward and try like to you yes. know really share mm -hmm. and make the other person comfortable whether they are an extroverted or an introverted person, but everyone you meet, basically, this is so basic social things, yes. I guess. Do not put yourself out there. Like, you need to, like, please do not be selfish in a way. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, okay, yeah. You can, do you understand what I mean? Like, yes. you need to take everyone in consideration, I guess. Yes, and... Yeah, I think it's, um, you know, uh, related to the point of don't change people for, like, accept people for who they are and not for who they, who you want they are. Them to be. Want them yes. to be. Yes. <laughs> oh my God, that was hard. Okay. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> so I think that is my final point on this topic that I, that yes. I really found inter interesting. Mm -hmm. So yeah, and did you like it, Leslie? Yeah, I told you it's it's such. You a... love it. <laughs> yeah, I love it. <laughs> so we're going to wrap up, but mm -hmm. before that, again, guys, please do not hesitate to send us voice message on the link. Yes, on every platform like you where or you can listen to the, us. Oh, with the hashtag W U U D and. Yeah. I won't say the other because it is too complicated to say in English. And um, turn turn on the notifications too. Yeah, for the podcast. If you're listening on Spotify, I know that you can do that. Uh, Apple yeah. Podcast, I don't really know. Overcast, I don't really know. <laughs> Google, I don't really know. So yeah, um, but yeah, turn on the notification and share with your friends. Yeah. And yeah. And That's, just thank you. Thank you, you know, again for this. Yeah, thank you. For thank listening. you for being here. And because I, yeah, I feel like this podcast is in, in a way making mm -hmm. us more comfortable with our daily yeah, life. Yeah, sure, and, totally. And talk about any subject. So that's really cool. And thank you guys for listening. Yes, and <laughs> yeah, it's grateful. pretty cool because um, you know we can express ourselves uh, without. Uh, you actually know, like, seeing everyone but yes uh, we know that you are listening and also we 
we can talk about anything you know it's not like in it's in school where you have a specific subject like we can talk about anything and it's pretty much cool that is a safe place here yeah anyway bye bye guys <laughs> bye and have a good day mm -hmm.